The pandemic has opened the eyes of black people in America and put emphasis on the fact that we must start working together and put our needs first. I'm Dr. Boyce Watkins of the Black Business School. I've teamed up with award-winning filmmaker Rick Mathis to poll over one million people with this intriguing question. What is it going to take for black people to start putting black people first? The world starts with love. Uh, Love is uh, the most powerful force in the universe. We've been conditioned for hundreds of years now to not love who we are. I believe that we're in the midst of a great awakening right now. It's going to take a very intentional effort to undo what society has done to us. We all are going through this experience together. So I encourage us to be less hard. We don't even say hi to each other on the streets. But when we lead with love, it's amazing how different our lives will look when we lead with love at all times, not just when it's convenient for us or not just when we receive it first. Love is nice, but the biggest thing is what creates your opportunities is what you own and control. But, but now you better get yourself some money. So I got kids that support man and grandkids and, and they got to eat, man. And, and I can tell them I love them. They're going to need some clothes on their rear. To truly obtain black power, black people must first begin by looking within ourselves and realizing our true power. We have to stop looking for validation outside of our community. We've been waiting for people outside of ourselves to change in order to have what we desire when the true power is actually within us. If we're able to see ourselves and understand that we come from kings and queens, that we are the source, without us, nothing moves. The whole world needs black power. And as long as black power is suffering, then you know, everybody's going to be suffering. They think they're going to steal from us, rob from us, beat us down, chain us, and they're not going to suffer from that. No Chinese person, no Latino, no, no Arab. No Jew, no white man has ever had to be asked such a question. Nobody complains when an Indian man says he loves that Indian woman. Nobody complains when a Jewish man says I want to do business with my Jewish brethren. Nobody says a damn thing when a Chinese man says I only want to patronize Chinese businesses. Other races feel threatened when black people talk about putting black people first because they're smart, because they get it. They understand quietest kept elephant in the room that we're actually in a race. I'm Dr. Boyce Watkins. Filmmaker Rick Mathis and I present the thought-provoking film Be One the Movie, a documentary that examines what it's going to take for us to start putting black people first. However, the truth is that we're already first. We just need to accept it.